Good morning, skiers and riders. Sugarloaf and Carabasset Valley. It's time to take a check of your latest local forecast and info to know before you go. You can find this anytime on all your internet devices at WSKITV.com. And this uh, weather report is brought to you by Village to Go. Check them out in Village West. For today, we're looking at summer temperatures cold below zero. Base temperatures in the single digits to lower teens. We'll see a gusty north-northwest breeze, especially higher on the hill. So it'll be a day to... Uh, Take advantage of the gorgeous uh, ski conditions out there, but you'll just have to bundle up. Wear those face masks as well as those uh, mittens rather than those gloves. Downhill Supply Company has all your cold weather gear and even uh, foot and hand warmers. Becoming mostly sunny for the day on Sunday, we'll see summit temperatures warming up to the teens. Base temperatures in the lower 20s and that wind should die down, so it should be a great day to get out there and rip it up. Monday, the first day of February, coming in with mostly sunny skies. We'll see a high temperature of 31 degrees, so fairly mild compared to this weekend. And then Tuesday, we get a snowstorm coming in, so keep those snow dances going. And we should see a substantial amount of snow out there. And then things will taper off uh, as snow showers on Wednesday. Saturday, Birchwood Interior is bringing you your trail port. 92 trails to ski, actually 95 trails to ski and ride on. 12 lifts getting into to those runs. 65 trails groomed out last night. We have seen about 7 inches of new snow throughout the week, so it's skiing and riding and groomed. Grooming in, great. Uh, grooming on Timberline, Bridal Chain, Tote Road, Hayburner, King's Landing, couple passes on the east side of Skidder, Narrow Gauge, Competition Hill, Spillway and Sluice, all of Gondola Line, right from the summit, White Nitro from Spillway Crosscut Down, Wedge, Haywire, Candy Side, Lower Winters Way, Boardwalk, all the trails around the base area will be groomed out. Over on the east side, Hallback, Choker, Flume, Widowmaker, Ram Down, Two Hall, uh, off the King Pine Lift, off the Wiffle Tree Lift, Wiffle Tree, Buckboard, uh, Buckboard, awesome, Springboard, uh, slasher rollway as well as moose alley for the kids over on the west side scoot windrow good chance and west mountain snow making down on the birches should be shutting down and stomping grounds park is open as well as small park on the boardwalk uh, and they'll be getting the others open as soon as possible eight o'clock this morning snubber will get you up from the condos to the base lodge sawduster and skidway move you around the base area and the mooscalator will run today as well eight o'clock west mountain gets you up from the golf course 8 30 super quad skyline and both double chairs will start running double runner chairs uh, Double Runner East and West will get going. King Pine and Wiffletree get going as well at 8.30 this morning, servicing the east side and Timberline at 9 a.m. We'll keep an eye on those winds, so stay tuned to the Mountain Report, and we'll keep you updated. Tonight at the Sugarloaf Outdoor Center, 5 to 7 p.m., Moonlight Snowshoe Safari included guided service, snowshoe rentals, cookie, and hot chocolate, so go check that out tonight. But they've got great cross-country skiing down there. The ice skating is in great shape. Fat biking is good to go, uh, so they've got rentals for all that stuff and some great eats and drinks at the Boo Moose Bakery and Cafe. The fat bike trail conditions down off the narrow gauge pathway are all in great shape. Grassy Loops was a little soft, but uh, folks have been riding it, so hopefully it's nice and packed in. So go and uh, ride all that stuff in. The more riders, the better. And the snowmobiling is in uh, open shape. Some of the things are uh, fairly low snow conditions out there, but the snow over this week has helped, and the snowstorm coming on Tuesday will definitely help as well. So just be safe out there. Ride safe. Anti-gravity complex for your indoor activities. You may want to give them a call before you head down there just to make a reservation. Make sure there'll be room for you. And be sure to check into our mountain reports this morning, 7.30 to 9 a.m., as well as Sunday morning, 7.30 to 9 a.m. We've got a bunch of live reports from people out around the mountain, so you can know before you go. Also, check this out. ResortTVResearch.com slash survey for your chance to win a custom-built Carver Titanium Obese mountain bike from our friends at Carver Bikes as well as Outside Television. Have a great day, folks. Stay warm, stay safe, and enjoy it.